And tonight, we're getting a new perspective on a brutal beating that was caught on camera in downtown Albuquerque. Police initially had a hard time finding the victim, but you're about to hear and see what happened when he finally came forward. KOAT Action 7 News reporter Kirsten Swanson has this new video. It's video that some may find difficult to watch. A man gets kicked in the stomach, then a blow to the face. Albuquerque police arrested John Hunter and Jeremy Kramer for this brutal beating that happened last month. Police spent two days looking for the victim until finally. Albuquerque police operator 4490. How may I help you? He called 911. I was beat up outside of Nakas, the women's club downtown. Okay, should they kick you in the head? Um, yes. Okay. After the operator took his information. Police, did you guys call? Two officers went to Messias' home. This is video from one of their lapel cameras. I do remember initially, I, I think I was mouthing off to one of the bouncers because okay. I was uh, trying to get back in and get my uh, mm -hmm. hat. Police then ask about what happened during the beating. Have you seen the video yet or no? Um, no, I don't want to. Uh, you don't want to? I, yeah, I can't. Then Macias shows the cops his injuries. In the lapel video, you see him pull down his lower lip to reveal a cracked tooth. He also shows them a knot on his head. Macias then admits he did not go to the hospital after it happened. In Albuquerque, Kirsten Swanson, KOAT Action 7 News. In Albuquerque, police say no one called 911 the night of that beating. They did get several calls the next day after people saw the video on Action 7 News, also on social media as well.